Hello, Saka Fat. Hi, I'm Roma, and welcome to my kitchen. Today, I'm going to be making Wiener Schnitzel. So, if you want to see how I make this recipe, keep watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you never miss an episode. So today for this meal, I'm using pork and um, you can use veal or chicken, whatever meat you like. So what I did was I had a, a pork loin and I just cut it into slices like this. Okay. And then I tenderize it with the tenderizer and this is what it looks like. And you can see all the little holes in there. I have my breadcrumbs, my flour, egg, and I'm having mushrooms and onions with it. So that's it and I have all of them here now what I'm doing with this is I like to season and I know most of the time they just go like this and dry it up but I'm gonna put some seasoning on it for so salt seasoned salt okay that's good and I'm gonna put a little bit of garlic powder as well Okay, that's it. And some white pepper. First thing, guys, I'm going to do here before I bread it is season the flour. So I'm just putting a little bit of white pepper, some garlic powder, and some salt, seasoned salt. Because you want it with some seasoning. Okay, so we put enough salt. That's good. Next step, I'm gonna crack these two eggs. And I'm gonna add about four tablespoons of water. One, two, three, all right, four. Okay, and then I'm just gonna beat that up. Okay guys, so we're gonna get this going. And the first thing I'm gonna do is put just dip it in the flour, shake it off, then into the egg wash, and then into the breadcrumbs. See, just like that. And then I'm putting it on my plate here. So I'm just going to do all of them, and then we're going to fry them. And again, for this, I'm using my Italian bread crumbs because they're nice and seasoned. I like seasoning, guys. So the next thing we're going to do is fry these. See, and that's what they look like, all breaded. So we're going to fry them up. Look at that. Oh, yeah, that's good. And maybe I can put two because I don't want to crowd the crowd it up. So we'll put this two in here. And we want to make sure they're covered up nicely. So while this is drying, I'm going to do my mushrooms. So these are already washed and I'm just going to pour them in here. And all we're going to use is some lemon and some salt, seasoned salt. So let's see guys, no it's not ready yet, it's still brown enough. This I want to keep it on a low heat, I don't want it too fast. What I can do too is like put a little salt. So I'm going to use some seasoned salt, this one's done. See how nice and golden that is, guys? That one's done. Put it on here with some paper. All right, that's one. So I'm just going to pour the lemon juice on that now. See, so now it's making that little sauce that I want. Okay, guys, so look at that. The mushrooms are cooking up really nicely. So I want them to cook enough before I put the onions because I don't want onions cooking too much. It's good. So 
So now we're gonna put the onions here. Oh, look at that. It's done. The thing with pork is that you wanna make sure when you're cooking pork that it is really well cooked. You guys, this is what's gonna go with the schnitzel, the mushrooms, and some onions, and the lemon butter sauce. So we're gonna turn it off and just let it sit until we're ready for it. Actually, I think I'm just gonna add a little more butter in there. And let it just be there and melt. All right, that's it. That's the whole mushroom. Looking good, looking good. Yum, yum. And here it is, guys. Our delicious Wiener Schnitzel. I am serving it with some mushrooms and onions and some roast potatoes. Thank you for watching. Until next time, guys, have yourselves a great day and God bless.